spirituality and patient care is, is, is another component of how we treat people. So without considering that person's spiritual, the, as the spiritual aspects of their life, not what we see it, but how they see it, um, I think if we don't address those issues, we're, we're missing a very important uh, part of the, the restorative process. When somebody comes in with a problem, presents themselves for help, uh, early on, one has to kind of have a pretty good working knowledge of what's this person got going for them? And so you look at education, you look at family support, social supports, and one of the things that I think is, is sorely missing is where is this person coming from spiritually? And frequently, uh, when you ask that question, um, people tell you something about their religious experience, and you say, yes, I, 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 I hear what you're saying, but tell me a little something more about you from a spiritual standpoint. And what's been my experience is that lots of times people have, clearly they have strengths, they may have a long connection with religion, it's very positive, social connections, so forth and so on. Other times they've had bad experiences with religion, and so they toss out the baby with the bathwater, as it were. They toss out any concern about their spirituality uh, with, because they've had this bad religious experience. So when I talk about spirituality, I'm talking about their capacity to relate to other people, to relate to something bigger than themselves, uh, to see strength um, in nature, in, in whatever they can relate to that is bigger than they are, whole issues of gratitude, issues of forgiveness, um, those kinds of things that if they aren't asked, you'll never know whether the person has that capacity to relate to those issues that so frequently is, is absolutely critical to, to their improvement, to their, to their relief of pain. Uh, much of my opinion is born out of uh, years working with alcoholics and drug abusers, uh, whether they be adolescents or old men, or old women. Uh, it's all the same picture, and I think AA provides us, uh, Alcoholics Anonymous, uh, Narcotics Anonymous, provides an enormous amount of wisdom in terms of paying very close attention to what are the spiritual elements of a person's life as really a platform for cure and recovery.